Afternoon, guys. This is Klein. You know, coming out to you from the Klein Corner. I am still at work. Um, I'm on lunch right now, but again, I wanted to reach out to you guys really quick. Uh, this video is going to be another questions video um, on my Facebook. I had people reach out to me with questions that they just want me to just go ahead and answer, regardless of my knowledge base or anything that suggests whether I know anything or don't know anything. So, again, I've done no research. I have no idea what anything is with anything. So, I'm just going to bang out a few questions here and we'll see how it goes. All right. So, and again, I don't have like a script or anything. I'm just like the phone again. So, here we go. Uh, so, first question is, um, I'll just use a first name. We're not going to put anybody out there. So, this is just from my buddy Matt. He says, can children become addicted to screen time? Absolutely not. I'm, I'm kidding. That's not my, ex my actual opinion. Um, so, yeah, I think that uh, children can become addicted to screen time. Um, I think that children especially, they can... They're much more easily influenced by things growing up, so they can become addicted to anything that um, they spend a lot of time doing growing up. It kind of lays the foundation for their hobbies and things that they do as they get older. Um, so, yeah, I do. I do think so. Um, second question is, uh, do preservatives in food change the rate a body that ate them decays? Rather, do they preserve the body? I don't know. Next. Do you think today's culture depends more on what celebrities say about politics? If so, why? That's a good question, actually. I don't know if culture itself <clears throat> um, influences politics. It's really about the people. Some people are charismatic in such a way where they affect everyone around them. Um, it's very intoxicating. They want to emulate that person that they deeply respect or they want to adopt that person's style. You see that a lot. Um, culture is always there, but it's how people adopt them that really determines how things go. <clears throat> now, as far as politics, my two cents, I try, to, I try to stay away from politics. I personally don't think so. Um, politics is just politics, and people will influence politics more than a specific culture. Um, it's just my two cents on that. Uh, let's see. <laughs> this next one. Good grief. What year was the tree sprouted that created the oldest piece of wood in your house? That is a really good question. But since I went and I just moved into that place like this summer, I don't have an answer for that. So who knows? Uh, the house looks like it's from the 1970s, so I don't know how old the tree is, or I, I don't know. So, eh. <clears throat> That's the best I got for you, sorry. I'd like to give you more, but no. Uh, and then the last one. How do they make Jello green? So, I don't know. There's a process, and I have no idea how that process is maintained. So, it's just green because it is? I don't even, I'm not going to quote chemicals and stuff, because I have no idea. So, I'd rather just, you know, admit that I'm an idiot in that field, instead of trying to say stuff that just makes me look like an idiot in that field. I don't see how that makes a difference. Anyway, that's all I got for you guys. Um, <clears throat> stay tuned. We'll do another um, episode of this, see how it goes. I got to get back to work. My lunch ends in a few minutes. So with that, this is Client signing out. Be sure to like and subscribe. If you like what you see, we'll put out more content. You guys have a good day. Later.